are worse than others, while some are better than others. Some days we are absorbed by fulfillment and success. In others, we suffer with our failures. Life is all about having balance. In most days, it seems as though that's a pipe dream at best. That's the very paradox of life. We suffer through hardships, pain, anguish, love, loss, only to die with lost fortunes and personal truths. So what do we do? Give up? Cave to the inevitable? That's for you to decide. Not everyone warrants living. If you in turn believe everyone can and should be saved from their own demise, you're naive in denial of the human condition. Yes, it's tragic when someone takes their own life via their own hands or through self-destructive drug use. Yes, I've had to watch many a friend's coffins being lowered into the earth. Yet what do you do? Drown yourself in the sorrow of the what-ifs and blame yourself? No. We accept the cards that were dealt and we choose whether continuing forward is worth it. Our society views suicide as a lack of autonomy when in reality it's the most in-depth form of autonomy you could develop, even though it is entirely selfish to leave your loved ones in the wake of such tragedy. Depression and creating self-harm is a disease. Yet did anyone ask them why they lack healthy habits in the mental or physical? Did anyone ask why they stuff their face full of Cheetos while they rotting on their couch? Did anyone ask why they refuse to take any athletic measures to better themselves? More simply, but harsh, which is what we need more of, honestly. Did anyone ask if they wanted to be created into existence? Did their parents have a conversation with them before they came to be? Of course not, it's impossible. But you as a human are thrust into being through all the conflict and difficulties that life provides, and then are expected to keep a stable job which you hate, buy a house you can't afford, and support a family that relies on you. Many allow the trauma of their past to dictate their future potential and say nay, and in turn take the easy way out. Life will never be easy. It will constantly attempt to pick away and cut you to your core. It will attempt to bring you to your knees while you plead mercy. For me, I accept the trials and tribulations that will come, not as some type of sadomasochist. No. I accept it because it would be a dishonor to my family, my parents, and most importantly, all of my ancestors who came before me. There is no greater shame in this life than to spit in the face of those who brought you to being supported you and who loved you more than they loved themselves. So my dear friend, I politely request that you ask yourself the following. Do you believe you were placed here to be a mere average mortal and live in accepted misery? Or are you brought into existence to become a miraculous immortal that fought their way to personal happiness?